Hi, this is Chong. Let's take a quick look of this program scenario, Rapid Sequence Induction or Intubation. Right above, the patient monitor reveals the package of parameters commands. On the lower left column, the eye and air windows is extracted from the instructor applications to reflect the mannequin's response in inductions. On the left top column, the simulation commands are programmed according to individual state and activations of a state mean bundles of predetermined commands will be executed with customized sequence. For instance, in some state, SPO2 transform earlier and faster as compared to other state or parameters. Preparation is the first state of the scenario. Mannequin appears slightly anxious with wide open eyes, audible reading sound, and quick verbal response from the mannequin's operator. Next, in pre-oxygenation state, mannequin regains consciousness as learner apply back valve mask ventilations and parameter fluctuate with the hyper-oxygenation. Subsequently, in pre-treatment state, IV fluid infusion started and parameter respond gradually. In these three states, mannequins will open eyes to stimuli but those off occasionally. The ETCO2 waveform initiated has the learner fix up the monitoring device. IV propofol injection is the signal for mannequin's operator to activate the state paralysis with inductions propofol. This state consists of unique parameter swing, loss of consciousness, and noisy breathing. Behind the stage, this state consists of four parts. The first two parts are bundles of parameters commands, which describe mannequin transformations from conscious to unconscious state. The last two parts of this stage are commands that incorporate with mannequin sensor to reflect parameters in positive pressure ventilations or apnea conditions. This state is designed to reflect the hemodynamic response to propofol injections with no complications of hypertension, medical history, or propofol induced hypertension. Thereafter, it will be the state of paralysis with induction succor metonium. With the injections of these neuromuscular blocking agents, mannequin's eyelids close completely, breathing ceased, and upper airway blocked by loosened muscles. The placement of endotracheal tube is another state require complex programming. It has four parts. Initial parts consist of parameters respond in prolonged apnea. The next two parts trigger cardiovascular reflex related to intubation processes, while the last part will take place upon back valve mask ventilation. Most intubation management contain commands of gradual parameters normalizations for surgical procedure. ETCO2 triggers are designed in such to allow quick manipulations to match learners' actions in ETCO2 monitoring. Finally, on the fly, inhale and end tighter desferrin is to reflect learner's manipulations of anesthesia machine.
Alright, that's all for this video. I hope that you will like it. Bye bye.